Okay, I'm a friend of uh, Sandra, as I told you, and uh, she, she says I should tell you a special message, uh, that I am your friend and I want you to be happy. Do uh, you understand the message? Yeah, I understand. Yeah. Yeah. And Sandra actually sent me, while I was in France, uh, your recipe for the barbecue sauce. Oh. And I must tell you that I tried it. It was really good. Yeah, it was very good. Although I didn't try it on the same kind of meat that you did. <laughs> <laughs> it's good on any kind of meat. Yeah, on any kind, yes. Um, I hear that you want to do a book of your recipes, of your cannibal recipes. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, because somebody, over, somebody overseas over there in Australia, they won $1,000 in a cooking contest. Oh, yeah? Yeah, it was, uh, I got a, a news article, uh, I got an article out of, out of the paper. Mm -hmm. Just wrote a book on it, you know. Saunders started writing the book on me, but uh, they said the book is too much in my favor, so uh, they turned the book down. So I reckon uh, she might end up selling it to Dollar Norris, so she might end up selling it to something. Or she might rewrite it again. I don't know what she's going to do. But as far as I'm concerned, she can go and write the book any kind of way she wants to write it. Mm -hmm. so whatever you put in a book, anyhow. People's gonna believe what they want to believe anyhow. Regardless if that's true or is it isn't true. So it don't it don't matter either way, you know. He's just stuck, so he just will face it. He just will kiss his ass goodbye and get sold to God and kiss the devil one. He's gonna have to get his mind right, which way he wanna go again. And what kind of guy was Henry when you met him? Ah, uh, he uh he was quiet, I understand. But you could never tell when he was up to something, you know. He was, he was always quiet, you know. I even tried to run in a, running off before, you know. And, uh, my parents say, no, you can't run him off. Uh, we want him to stay around. So I tried to run him off, you know. So uh, I couldn't run him off nowhere, you know. I really like Fox. I like my three stories high. Little bitty fires, they don't, they don't turn me on that much, you know. Big old fires turn me on, you know. Sometimes I can dream and I said, oh shit. I said, I wish I could see a fire about four or five stories high on the top of these buildings where all the shoot over the buildings. And I could be up there just getting off. <laughs> I can really get off there, you know. But you can't do none of that around here, you know. Not unless you build a little bitty fire. I ain't built no, built no fire since I've been here. Over the top of the buildings, you know. Really, really, really gets me off there. I like to do that in here, but there ain't nothing to burn, you know. You can see what it is. Nothing but concrete, you know. No wood, no nothing. All back there ain't nothing to burn, you know. Nothing but a mattress. And it goes out no time, imagine. You can't tell. Uh, most of the thing they got in here is fire resistant. It won't burn, you know. Not unless you get a whole pile of newspaper and pile it up. And they have been some people do that here, you know. And I stick my head out the window and watch all the planes coming outside the window, you know. I've seen people do it since I've been here. I'll just, <laughs> I'll just be getting off. I'll, I'll really be getting off. You know, seeing all the planes shooting outside. I seem to do it a lot since I get in here, you know. Oh, like he I didn't know what to think about it. My mind say, say so mess, messed up all the time until I don't know what, what to think about it, you know. He, uh, he had me going all kind of ways. I didn't know which way I wasn't going, which way I was coming or going, you know, so. I don't really know. You know? I was just the... Oh, he'd tell me to do a little bit of everything, you know. He would, uh, he was too much. He, uh, and then he killed her, and then I had sex with her after she was dead. 
And then he seen this damn goat, and he wanted to fuck this damn goat. I said, you something else. I said, you want to have sex with a goat? He had on a pair of boots, a pair of boots. He took that, took that billy goat's legs and put in his boots, and that, and that billy goat just, just a bucket, and he just carried on with that goat. Why he was having sex, that goat just a bucket boots. I said, I ain't never seen nothing like this in my life. Here you are having sex with a goat, goat man. You got his leg, you got her legs in your boots, and she can't get away, and she's just a bucket, and he's bucking with her at the same time, rocking back and forth, having sex with that goat. I ain't never seen a man so disgusted. He was too much. I don't know how I ever got tied up with that man. How would you kill the people? Not, uh, most any kind of way. Not no, not no one sort of way. Just most any kind of way. He was, he was disgusting. I didn't know if he's going or coming at the time. He would, uh, whoever cut the new member cut the person's throat would fuck the person, and then let an animal fuck her too. And then they would fuck the animal too. And then they would kill the animal too afterwards. And they would have a big feast. They would cook the, cook the person and cook the animal. And they would have a big feast. That was when you were in the cult of devil worshippers. Oh yeah. They would have a they would do that. It was there were so many people, you know, you couldn't you couldn't hardly tell who was who most of the time, because lots of times they would wear a mask or a hood or something over their head. But some of the members, you know who the members were, but uh, you can't uh, you can't give up the main uh, main part of what a code is, you know, because uh, to uh, it would be more helpful and worse than what it is. And so, uh, you can't get up with secret passwords. It's my crime. A long time ago, I was uh, I was special in that crime, but uh, it kind of came out in the book. It came out that uh, I ain't no one suspect for that no more. At one time, uh, they tried to say I'd done it, but uh, they found out I didn't do it. So. Uh, he came out in a book here a while back in a book called Henry, you know, so, uh, and I talked to the lawyer, you know, and uh, they said they know I wasn't down there at that time, they know I didn't do that crime. I mean, it was a, it was a big mess about that crime, you know, but uh, it wasn't my crime. See, if, uh, you, uh, if somebody writes to you, uh, and it's seen the money, you know. They had to put your prison number on there too. Mm -hmm. Don't be turning around and send it back. 